you know, one for sure is these entrepreneurial mastermind communities. I've invested, you know, if I was to quantify without exaggeration, at least a hundred or at least five hundred thousand dollars have I spent over the last fifteen years in being involved in mastermind communities. And and I could literally quant I can can draw it all out. That's not an exaggeration. So that's one plugging myself into these mastermind communities where I get at least a 10x return. Number two has been working on what I call the soft skills of leadership. So really working on my skills around things like situational leadership, delegation, managing conflicts, communication, kind of all of the executive functioning skills, work, working really hard on that. And then the third is probably that, that book, Leadership and Self-Deception, where I've really tried to to read some books to help me see myself from a perspective and realize that the feedback or negative criticism I hear about myself is is great feedback. I used to get very upset about it or get my back against the wall. And now I'm starving for feedback because I, I get all the praise because I'm doing all the speaking or I'm on this global stage. I don't, I don't even read the praise anymore. I'm really looking for that constructive criticism that I can improve on. So I think that's been a big growth for me is, is starting to embrace that uh, and see that, you know what, it's pretty accurate. There's some, cause there's some good truth in all that stuff. And then how do I continue to grow? If you like that video, you're going to love more here at watchcameron.com.